Well, tonight, Lisa, a new campaign to save a cherished cinema. The West Newton Cinema was sold last summer because of slumping sales during COVID. But as WBZ's Brandon Truitt tells us, the developer who bought it is giving the community one more chance to keep it up and running. The West Newton Cinema is um, a cultural icon. Sitting in the heart of West Newton Square is its namesake cinema that's been up and running for 85 years. And I've had folks that came here as young people come in with their grandchildren to see films. So. David Brabante has owned this theater for 45 years, but the pandemic left one too many seats empty, ticket sales were low. He was faced with the tough decision to sell it. No, never wanted to let it go. After, after 45 years. Bramante sold it to Mark Development. The company has been redeveloping a lot of this area, and they have plans to tear it down. But almost as fast as it sold came the effort to get it back. Uh, I went as a kid growing up. I've taken my nephews there. Susan Bernstein helped create a solution, the West Newton Cinema Foundation. The nonprofit is set up as a 501c3 and is currently raising money to buy it back. The developer agreeing to sell it back for its original purchase price if the group can raise the money. We need some major fundraising help. The group is on their way to raise nearly $10 million. The cinema sold for just over $5.5 million. The rest of that money would go toward renovations. They've got about a year and a half to raise the funds. We're up against the clock. We're up against a uh, milestone, so to speak, that we've got to start hitting some, some marks. And if we don't hit those, uh, it's hard to say what, what will happen. The West Newton Cinema Foundation is taking donations on their website. We've put a link on WBZ.com. It would be great. It would just be wonderful to see this saved. A community rallying around the cinema, hoping to punch the ticket that keeps it around. In West Newton, Brandon Truitt, WBZ News.